what up though it's your girl coco and we are back with another video okay as you can tell by the title below we are camping okay oh. we are camping okay so just a little psa this is our first time camping well this is like my first time camping where i'm the one planning everything and i'm an actual adult and i'm responsible for another human being so yeah so this is our first time camping okay um so i just kind of wanted to touch base on like some of the basic stuff that i have that's like your essentials um you will not see everything in this video because i'm trying to pack light but it's not working out it's like oh i feel like i need this i need that but i guess it's normal from the videos i'm watching it's pretty normal to overpack on your first one but we're just gonna go ahead and just show you guys what i got okay <laughs> Um, if you want a more in-depth video, like a, t what I'm bringing for my toddler, comment down below a toddler video, or you want like a grocery haul, what I'm doing, cause you will not see all of my groceries here. Um, comment down below and we'll get those videos out to you guys. Even if you don't, I'll probably do those videos anyways, but just comment to let me know that that's what you want to see. Okay. <laughs> Let's just get into it. Okay. So first I got this because we have nothing. So this is like bare bones, like we didn't have a tent or anything. First up, let's start with the tent actually. Let's start with the tent. So first we are using the Ozark Trail Outdoor Equipment Modified Dome Tent. It's a 10 person tent. It's huge, okay? It's only four of us going. Yeah, it's only four of us going. So it's plenty of room for all of us and it has like rooms in it. So it's super, super cool. And um, we couldn't get back in the bag. So <laughs> that's why it's sticking out. But yeah, we just got it and it was on sale. It was like literally 70 bucks. And for a 10 person tent from what I've seen, that's like a pretty good deal. It's waterproof. We tested it in the rain. It had We had a pretty big storm. It was good, no leaks. Love that, okay? and we didn't put the tarp down below it so it worked out shout out to um ozark not sponsored but you'll see ozark pop up a lot okay <laughs> anyways so then we got this nature um queen size i'll put it up here this is a sleeping bag uh just because I don't know we're all gonna all three of us are gonna me my boyfriend and our son is gonna literally sleep in the same bed um like we do now and it's a queen size so i got a queen sleeping bag and then of course we'll have like our own blankets and we're bringing our snuggies just in case it does get cold um so we got that i'll put a picture of everything up here um if you want to see it like all set up and everything there'll be pictures um, so we got that and then to go along with that we are using a air mattress i know we were gonna get like the little air pad that you just like pump up with your foot but i found a solution to like the whole um air pump deal as you'll see later so we got this ozark trail it holds about 660 pounds now we, we don't make up that so we're less than that so as a group as a whole um it has a fast release valve and it's supposed to like not pop easy so it's a 10 inch queen size mattress super simple cool and then you have like the mattress bed i think we'll be fine so there's that and then we got our chairs so this is the real tree edge um I got the camo pattern because it's pink and it's cute. Um, this is a triple reinforcement count, uh, corners, prevents tearing, and then the mesh cup holders, like super basic. It's a big chair. So I got this for me. My son really just wanted a red chair. He's like, I want a red chair. I guess it reminds him of Spider Man, but I couldn't find a Spider Man one. So I got him this one. And then 
just for giggles and grins, I got my boyfriend this one because I thought it would be cool. <laughs> so I got him this one. So we have that. And then we're going to kind of go into like our, our pantry because it's not our refrigerator. Our cooler is currently being dry. I like power washed it. So it's outside getting dried. This is like our snacks. Um, I haven't gone grocery shopping, but I, I see something on sale. I kind of picked it up. So that's kind of what this is. It kind of accumulated. So first, uh, marshmallows. These were at Dollar Tree for like $1.25, well, obviously. But y'all know that they changed their prices. This is $1.25. So I got the stuffed ones. And then I got these. If you didn't see my Target video, my Target bargain video, I'll put it up here. But my son literally just likes throwing marshmallows in the fire he thinks it's like the funnest thing ever so i got these just so he can do that and then these will be the ones that we actually use for the s'mores and then i get the cinnamon um graham crackers because that's just top tier like if you get the regular honey like boo you gotta get the cinnamon for s'mores it's top tier so i got that and then i got this uh cafe bustello um instant coffee because this is top tier if you get any other instant coffee don't know what to tell you this whole this brand is just super good and then i just got this french vanilla like it was a dollar at dollar general um clover valley just coffee creamer food because i'm not bringing a french press i thought about it and then me and my friend she was like no you don't need a french press just get the instant coffee so we got that and then I thought this would be fun. These are just like those little like campfire popcorn that you just like put over the fire and then it pops. I don't know if that would be fun. And then we could do like a mini movie night or something. So got that. And then for like road trip snacks, I got this. I got this at the Bass Pro Shop. <laughs> these are just peach rings. These are like my favorite candy. So I got these. And then I got this at Ollie's. This is like the Black Forest um gummy bears so i like the black forest brand i get the fruit snacks for my son so gummy bears like win win right and then we got the kodak power um cakes this is the flapjack quick mix and i believe you just yeah you just add water and then you like put it on there on the cast iron we're bringing cast iron because they have grills that you can rent out, but like we're trying to really be feral with it. You know what I'm saying? As feral as possible, but like not too crazy. <laughs> like not glamping, but like luxury feral. Is that a thing? Yeah, we're trying to luxury feral it out. That's what it is. And so for one night, we'll have the protein and then another night, we'll just have some fun shake and pour biscuit this was 90 cents so i had to get it like what okay so i picked that up if we don't use it then we don't use it and it will just be in my prepper pantry but got those okay pancakes it's just a fun thing to have pancakes like while you're camping and then as like another snack we have these fit fit strawberry fruit strips this and then we have just like these re ritz like cheese crackers and that's just something very basic like these are just like snacks mainly and then i'll take you guys along when i go grocery shopping um i'm just waiting so it's a little bit closer because if i get it now i'm gonna have to get it again because these boys be eating okay <laughs> so then in my tote In my tote, I have like, okay, so this is a mini USB air pump. I got this at Bass Pro, I believe. And you literally, I have to test it out. So that just reminded me. This, you just literally put it in like the USB port and it charges or blows air. And so I thought that was cool. You could use a car charger. You can use like, it's really universal. So, and this was like 14 bucks. So this is the cheapest one that I saw. The other little portable one that I saw that was just like battery powder powered, it was like 35 bucks. You know, that was not in the budget, okay? It wasn't in the budget. Camp is supposed to be cheap. It ain't supposed to be, yeah, like this is supposed to be, nah, that ain't my thing. And then we got, <laughs> I got this portable fan. This was also 14 bucks. I got this off of Amazon, 
we have like two of them i think one's usb powered and then this one you just like pre charge it i believe i need to figure all this out before we go and then we be yeah this one you just pre-charge and it has a low high and strong setting and it's also a light so i liked that and you can hook, hang it up it has a hook so super cool yeah i saw that okay so got that <laughs> and then we have a bunch of these um i'm trying to refrain for i was going to get another one but I'm trying to think because it's like my phone, like this charges multiple things. So it's like my phone, my boyfriend's phone, I think my friend has one. And then I have like, um, I was trying to wait till everything came in to do this video, but I don't really care. Um, but I have like a power bank coming out and it has like a light and then it has like an actual like wall plug. I forgot, like it's like an AC plug or something like that. So it has that and then it has like a bunch of USBs. So. I think that will be good with I think we have three of these and then that power bank we should be good to kind of give our campground some some life and do a thing and then I saw this at Dollar Tree I've actually haven't played dominoes I think since I was like 10 so I just thought it was fun to have this little cool little dominoes double nine dominoes 55 piece to play um, while we're out there um, and then I have these reusable Ziploc bags just in case we have like extra food or something like that. I have these and then I also have the freezer bag, the double zippers. This is a quart size, so got those. And then some napkins. And then I got this. This was also at Bass Pro, I believe. This is the collapsible water container. Y'all see that? Um, I'm also bringing my aqua brick as well. If y'all haven't seen my prepper video, I'll just put a picture here and I'll link the video up here. But it's just like a big, like a seven gallon. This is a five gallon, but it like collapsed and I like that. So when we're done with it, we could just put it up. We don't have to bring the big old thing. Um, I believe they have water there. They, yeah, I believe they have water there. It's just cold water and like showers but it's just cold water we're just trying to dug it out um so <laughs> i got this because it was collapsible and i think this was like six dollars like why not okay why not you know and then i could use it for emergencies purposes right so i got that and then this is just like our toiletry bag so this has like our toothpaste toothbrush shampoo body wash face wash baby wipes things like that now that's if we get the chance to go to the shower they said it keeps go it goes in and out so i can't guarantee that so because of that i got these little like crest on the go little toothbrush and toothpicks and then i got this ultra max face and body wipes just in case like we don't have shower we could just do a little quickie you know type deal <laughs> with that and get the important parts and then this is like our mosquito sunscreen type deal. So we have these bands. These are just like the little Centronella wristbands, easy to use, simple. We have those and then we have the mosquito repellent patches. These are eight hours. Then we have the after bite in case all that don't work and you actually do get bit, we have that. And then we have the um, repellent that like you just put on. It's like a plant-based repellent. You just wipe on like sunblock. We have the kids sunscreen stick. We have like a little mini um, first aid kit. So this just has like chapstick, um, band-aids, alcohol wipes, some um, antibiotic ointment things like that super simple just to have on hand and then we have a big thing of sunblock for everybody waterproof um there is like a fishing hole and they have they have like a swimming hole they have horseback riding and things like that so we'll be outside for sure so got that um i do have like some centronella candles 
to put around the campsite just like while we're out vibing because we'll be arriving to the campsite pretty late so i know the mosquitoes won't try to get us so i just have this in a separate bag been packing it in the toiletries just so we can we can have it ready for whenever we get there okay got that and then this is for the cooler this is just a four pack little ice packs these are the ultra slim so you could just lay it on it doesn't take up too much space um in the cooler so we got those and then we have this this is a pine mountain starter log um it has four six four start packs so there has 24 starts um they're like little thin little starters that you can put in the thing um it says lights wood fast it's an indoor and outdoor um i just this was on clearance for five dollars at walmart so i picked it up this is like when we first started planning the trip i forgot we had that so that's cool and then i have the infamous survival kit that everybody was just super mad that i got so i have this <laughs> um with us it has like um hammer shovel first aid kit all kinds of fire starters fishing all kind of stuff in there if you want to see the in-depth video and you want to look at the comments of that video i'll put it up here <laughs> for some reason everybody was really mad that i got it so i got that bringing that along and then i also got a duracell this is a headlamp and a flashlight type deal um just to have on hand i have another headlamp that we've had for a long time but i thought like most people should have a headlamp especially if we're arriving late to do the tent and stuff like that have that and then we have just like your standard um lantern then we have another flashlight and then another flashlight that has like the sides on there and then we have another portable um charger pack and then we have another kind of flashlight deal that kind of just stands up it does like the front and like a flashlight so it has a front cob and then it has a side led light super super fun super simple i'm excited for this trip if you're new to camping or you're an experienced camper comment down below and let us know what you bring or what is like your essential top five things that you bring during camping that's not like a typical like tent or things like that i feel like i'm doing good i feel like we're good i think the only thing that we need um left is like our groceries and then like our kitchen i'm not going to show you our kitchen stuff like get get a pan guys get a boil thing that boils water and get you some utensils okay okay um but yeah <laughs> comment down below what are some of your five favorite things or essentials that you bring during camping and um i hope this video was enjoyable for you guys i hope it helps out and um i'm excited i'm super excited to go but um, I'll see you guys in the next one. We might be shopping. We might be in the kitchen. Or we might be talking about camping. Who knows? I'm always keeping you on your toes. Peace.